Well, if you've been watching our newscasts, you've seen it by now. The video of a giant cup of spicy soup being thrown in the face of a Temple restaurant manager. Yeah, it's a terrible scene. It could have been a whole lot worse, but as Six News' Bailey Bates reports, the community is making sure Sol de Jalisco knows they have support. A viral video puts Temple, Texas on the map. And my jaw just dropped. From coast to coast, overseas, and right here in Central Texas. It's a scene that Hallie Ainsley says is hard to believe. Boggles my mind that someone that a lot of people know in this town probably would do something like that. But not only is Temple on the map, Sol de Jalisco is now on people's menu. Ever since the soup throwdown, Ryan Lemer, a server at the restaurant, says there's more traffic. It's picked up in consideration like on a year-to-year -year basis, and people definitely have been coming through just to ask questions. Taking his first order of menudo since the incident. My first response was, you're not going to throw it at me, are you? After some time, it's something they can make light of. So, well, the small 16 ounces and the largest throwing size. But it's because of the overwhelming support and positivity from across the country. It makes it easier to deal with at the same time. You get mad for anybody that's in the same shoes as you having that happen to them. Although now known as Menudo Girl, Janelle Brolin has truly made it worldwide. People are even calling the restaurant from that don't even live in the area. The outreach is coming from every angle, social media, customers, and overall, just nice gestures. I had somebody send me flowers today. So everybody has just been so unbelievably kind and it really puts my faith right back into people. But as eyes are on the horrific scene, she hopes people take a lesson from her soup assault. I do hope people are, like I said before, I hope people are just more more patient and more understanding. That her and her co-workers and all others in the industry get the respect. With putting on an apron and a name tag does not make us robots. We're still people. In Temple, Bailey Bates, 6 News. First of people to the best of people. <sighs>